money, happiness. What is the relationship? Wealthy people are said to be happier than poor people. But how much money does one need to be satisfied? Hello, this is Omar Adil and in these videos we're going to discuss some topics in order to increase your fluency and your knowledge about these general topics. By the end of the video you will find the new vocabulary and their definitions. Oh, yeah. In a study, the researchers found no correlation between wealth and happiness. However, they found a correlation between living standards and happiness. So the amount of money one would need to be satisfied is not a fixed number, but will vary from person to person. Happiness and money are associated as long as one earns less than $75,000 per year, according to a study conducted by Princeton University in 2010. A higher income may end this correlation between money and happiness. According to a 2018 Purdue University study, persons can achieve satisfaction with life with a yearly cash increase of $95,000. A new study by the University of Pennsylvania found that the benefits of increased wealth don't stop once the person reaches a certain level, even in cinema industry. Happiness and success have been depicted as being rich or at least having financial stability. The director of the well-known movie, The Pursuit of Happiness, showed the life of a man named Chris, who's fighting to make a better life for his family. After overcoming adversity and hurdles, he achieved financial security by landing a job as a broker. However, economic growth is not the only factor for happiness. Other factors, social connection in particular, may contribute more to one's happiness. It is vivid in how one always feels happy when his social connections witness his achievements. In the pursuit of happiness, Chris ran to share his joy with his son. Indeed, the real motivation for his struggle and hard work was his son. In a nutshell, economic growth is vital for happiness but it should be supplemented by other elements, such as social connections. Now let's look at some things that we may learn from this speech. Correlation, a connection between two things in which one thing changes as the other does. Associated, if one thing is associated with another, the two things are connected because they happen together. Stability, the quality or state of being steady, and not changing or being upset in any way. Adversity, a difficult or unpleasant situation. Hurdles, a problem or difficulty that must be solved or dealt with before you can achieve something. Vivid, producing very clear pictures. Supplemented, to add something to something in order to improve it, or make it more complete. Now tell me your opinion in the comment, do you think money is related to happiness or not, and why? Don't forget to subscribe in order to see the new videos. Thank you for watching, bye bye.